campus security force insisted on calling the Chicago police to press charges against me. But they found a sudden surprising resistance from Dr. C. Evans Spate, who claimed the tablet had been broken accidentally. And despite verification by a confused and frightened Michael Thompson, neither reporter Ms. Rosalind Winters nor I had enough hard evidence to file a story. It had all turned to dust. However, published story or not, I can only say to you that should you ever meet a young woman who seems just too lovely to be really of this world, well, just remember, there's a very good chance that she isn't. Thank you.